Welcome back to VV Flex, and today I wanted to speak about the drop that's happening tomorrow, February 25th. VV is dropping the Uncanny X-Men issue 282, and this is going to be the first appearance of Bishop. Now, I don't know if you guys are familiar with him. I remember him from the X-Men animated series in the 90s. Um, I also remember him from a recent X-Men movie, like, I don't know, six or seven years ago, probably longer than that. I think it was like X-Men Days of Futures Past, like time traveling and stuff like that. So he's basically an X-Men from the future. He comes to the present day, but in the future, I think like all the X-Men are dead. I think the Sentinels end, end up killing like a lot of them. And there's only like Wolverine and Professor X left. But let's take a look here at the summer and it says here first appearance of bishop everybody's favorite time traveling x-men the x-men have returned to the mansion with the body of gene gray but is gene really dead professor x has the answer but who are these strange mutant visitors from the future so it says here vivi's releasing two exclusive rare and ultra rare covers made by carlos gomez they're going to be a 30,000 edition size altogether. Let's take a look at the covers here. This is the co common cover with 21,000 editions. And we can see here Bishop, we can see Forge. I'm not sure who that blonde guy is. I believe Bishop's power is like he could throw energy. I think he absorbs energy and he's able like to throw it back or something like that. So this cover is pretty cool. I wouldn't mind getting this cover here. Now let's take a look at the uncommon. And the uncommon is going to have 5,000 additions. And same thing, black and white. I'm not really fan of the black and white, but this one looks pretty cool with the energy and Bishop being highlighted. So I wouldn't mind this one as well. This one's pretty dope. Let's take a look at the rare. This is the exclusive cover. And this one's not bad. It's fully black and white. But I like how they highlighted like the X-Men and like the way Bishop is drawn here is pretty cool. This one is going to have 2,350 additions and the ultra rare is going to have 1,050 additions. And I really like this cover too. I like the colors that they used. It's pretty similar to the rare one just in color, but the way they put it together, I really like it. And let's take a look at the secret rare with only 600 additions. And it shows here Bishop choking somebody here and about to blast them. And with the white background, I'm not too fond of, but I gotta say, I kinda like all these covers here. I'm, it's not too bad. Now let's take a look at the real world value of this comic book. And according to gocollect.com, a 9.6 is worth $100, a 9.2 is worth $55, and a 9.0 is worth $44. Now, what's my opinion? Is this a hold or a sell? I'm going to say that this, according to that price, is going to be a sell. He's already been in the animated series. Some people know about him. He was in the movie. I believe the, the comic book kind of went up in price during that time, but it's still not worth that much. I personally will probably buy maybe the common. I like that cover, the uncommon, and possibly even the rare just because I'm an X-Men fan. I'm trying to collect all the X-Men comics, and you know I wouldn't mind having it. But for profit-wise, it doesn't look like it'll be worth much but guys that's not financial advice you guys do your own research and determine what you guys want to do comment down below and let me know which one is your favorite cover which one are you excited about and let me know what do you know about bishop do you know this character and as always guys stay flexing vv flex out